हेलो दिस इज डॉक्टर दानिश वेलकम टू योर साइंस क्लास इन टूडेज वीडियो लेक्चर आई विल एक्सप्लेन यू द रिमेनिंग टॉपिक ऑफ द रिप्रोडक्शन ऑफ रिप्रोडक्शन इन प्लांट्स सो एक्चुअली देर आर फ्यू टर्म्स विच आर वेरी असेंशियल टू नो वेन यू स्टडी रिप्रोडक्शन इन प्लांट्स सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल एक्चुअली आई मेड अ डाइग्राम हेयर ऑन माई लेफ्ट एंड as you know uh, as I, we have discussed in the earlier video lecture that the male part male reproductive part of a flower of a plant is known as stamen and stamen has two parts the flament the tube like structure is flament and the swollen part and the swell, swollen sac like structure is known as anther and the anther is the main part main component in which pollen grains are present and when this flower this male part reaches up to up to the maturity this anther bursts and the pollen grains come out when these pollen grains came out from the anther it may float with the air and it goes to the it it goes to the this arrow shows that the passage the path where it goes so the pollen grains go to the stigma the female part the female receptive part the female uh, flat part on which the pollen grains shed okay and here this is the female reproductive part and as you know that the flat part is known as stigma this tube like structure is known as style and the swollen part of female reproductive part which is on the base which is on the base is known as ovary okay clear so when the pollen grains come to the stigma this process this yeah this process is known as pollination and i have mentioned this term here p o d l l i n a t i o n pollination actually pollination is the i explain you here what is what exactly is pollination pollination is the transfer of pollen grains transfer of pollen grains from anther to stigma from anther to stigma this process is known as pollination so first of all for sexual reproduction pollination is the necessity okay and after pollination there would be fertilization now the question arises in your mind that what exactly what uh, what exactly is fertilization fertilization kya hai so fertilization is the fusion of male and female germ cells okay male and female germ cells is known as fertilization in short we can say that fusion of gametes fusion of male and female germ cells is known as is known as fertilization so here you can see when the pollen come to the stigma these pollen germinate this pollen builds a tube a tube like structure which goes inside the stigma which uh, which intrude the uh, the stigma then the style and it comes to the ovary region and in ovary region there is a structure known as ovule this ovule structure is known as ovule and inside the ovule and inside the ovule there is a female germ cells which is also known as which is also known as egg so it means egg is the female germ cells which is present inside the ovule clear now this tube come to the yeah or this uh, pollen tube penetrates the ovule and after after the penetration of the ovule this uh, tube deliver this male germ cells this male germ cell 
इनसाइड द ओव्यूल एंड इन ओव्यूल फर्टिलाइजेशन अकर्स ओके सो वेयर फर्टिलाइजेशन अकर्स फर्टिलाइजेशन अकर्स इन ओवरी एज वेल एज इन ओव्यूल बिकॉज ओव्यूल इज प्रेजेंट इन साइड द ओवरी सो ओव्यूल इन ओव्यूल एग एंड एग मीन्स फीमेल जम सेल्स एंड मेल जम सेल्स फ्यूजेस टूगेदर टू मेक अ सिंगल सेल ओके टू मेक अ सिंगल सेल एंड दिस सिंगल सेल इज नोन एज जाइगोट here is the term zygote zygote is the sum of male and female germ cells male germ cells and female germ cells when diffuses diffuse they form a zygote so zygote actually male germ cell is a cell is a single cell and uh, female germ cell is another single cell so these two single cells fuses to form a bigger single cell so zygote is a zygote is a single cell zygote is a single cell structure okay so after the after the formation of zygote inside the ovule the embryo develops what is embryo actually embryo is the next stage of zygote first stage is the zygote and the second second stage is the embryo so when zygote forms when zygote multiplies okay when zygote multiplies through mitosis and make many cells it means a embryo which is a multicellular organ it means zygote is a single cell which multiplies and make a embryo and embryo is a multicellular zygote is a single cell structure embryo is a multicellular structure clear so now the question arises in our mind that what is the fruit because this is the flower and after fertilization the flower converts into a fruit what happens actually after fertilization this stigma and style region shed off this is stigma and style region shed off it means uh, these regions separate from the ovary and this ovary become mature and ripen so the ripen ovary this ovary is known as the fruit when this ovary becomes ripen so what is the fruit fruit is the ripen ovary if somebody asks you that kindly define fruit so you will answer that ovary is a ripen sorry fruit is a ripen ovary fruit is a ripen ovary and inside ovary you find seeds and from where the seeds develop the seeds develop from this ovule okay the seeds develop from ovule from fertilized ovule so what is seed seed is the fertilized ovule okay and inside seed when you sow and when you want to grow some new plants so you sow the seeds into the soil and inside the seed there is a embryo this one and from embryo in embryo there are two parts plumule and radicle from plumule the shoot arises and from radicle the root goes down clear it means embryo has two parts plumules and radicles from plumule the shoot comes out and from the radicle the root will grow so i think this is the um, this is the all about uh, sexual reproduction in plants so we we will meet in the next video with some another type topics till then goodbye